today. Man, just lately I feel so amazingly good every single day. It is a great thing. Oh, oh Michael's wife's birthday is tomorrow. So as you know, we have a really crappy scale that never gives oh, consistent yeah. results. But the we fit you, but this whole thing was $18. So that's way that. cheaper than a scale, and this is supposedly a very accurate scale. So the Wii U is a nightmare of a system. No wonder it failed. But fortunately, somebody made a program that hooks up to your computer where you can weigh yourself. With all my clothes on, I am 157.6, for those of you who are interested. Ooh. Okay, gotta go do some stuff. Ooh, that sounded terrible. Okay, right here I've got organic strawberries. This is 8.8 .8 ounces for $4.99. Right here I've got conventional strawberries, which are 16 ounces for $3.99. That is cheaper for twice the weight. Now, I can't test nutrients which is the important part of getting organic, but I can test taste. And you know, people who poo poo organic and people trying to eat healthy, I understand why you do that because there's lots of very annoying people who are throwing it in your face and blah, blah, blah. But don't poo poo the sentiment behind wanting to be healthier. Like that's just ridiculous. And if you think that you don't need to be healthy then good on you, but don't tell other people not to do it. Okay, I don't know how to do this objectively. I mean, that conventional one was pretty good. I've got quite a bit of hunger spice right now, but. Mmm, that organic one was also really good. Try again. Bite it in half and take a look. This one wasn't as good as the last conventional. Oh man, in this particular case, there is no question that the organic is better. This is the organic, and the other one's the conventional. Grown right. Not right. Oh, not right? Yeah. Oh, maybe that was a problem. So some of you have been curious as to why I have a industrial hand dryer in the garage. So when my mom and I, we had our own Zumba studio, we had a bathroom that we had to take care of. And we got really tired of buying paper towels, so we bought one of these. Now it's just sitting here doing nothing. So I'm trying to sell it on eBay with little success so far. I'll probably have to lower the price where I have it at. Anyways, it's, what day is this, Friday? Yeah, it's Friday. There's two Adventure Archives videos I could be working on right now. But whenever we finish one of those episodes, I'm like so, creatively tapped out that I just really don't want to dive into another episode yet and I need like a week or two to reset my brain. And I don't have any other jobs right now, so I'm pretty much completely free. And it feels great, don't get me wrong, but I'm just kind of like, man, you know, I don't have anything I need to get done right now. Thanksgiving is next week. It already feels like it's time to start partying and having fun. Just feels really nice. I feel like my life is kind of like very nicely buttoned up right now. I'm very content, very happy. I don't feel like I need anything. Like, isn't that kind of like annoying sometimes when you just want and you don't know what, do you ever yearn? Do you ever yearn? That can be a good feeling because it's like a catalyst for change, but it can also be a very unsatisfying feeling because you're always just like, man, I need to be, like I'm yearning. I don't feel that way at all right now, but it feels kind of weird because I'm like, oh, I'm good. I'm good, right? Still got to do the push-ups. All right, thank you for watching today's vlog. See you tomorrow.
but I can test taste. But I can taste, test taste? That was right, right? <laughs> but I can test taste. And I'm gonna te test the taste right now. 